Okay, that's, that's, that's great, but I finally have, well, it's not quiet, but I have a small amount of time to introduce everyone to the brand new episode of everyone's favorite series on this channel, Persona 3, who the hell? Dude, it's, who makes plans on Tuesday? I ain't gonna pass it up. Anyway, uh, what was I saying? Oh yeah, welcome to the brand new episode and, uh... No. Okay. New episode of Persona 3, or at least... Hopefully, if I don't get frustrated and bash my head in and stop trying to record Persona 3. But we are past all the stuff I knew already, which was the main roadblock to me recording because I already knew what was going to happen with the Fuka stuff, but now I have no idea what's going to happen. Maybe I'll upload the P3 portable stuff. That's just me complaining. But then yet again, that's not different from my normal content of just me complaining. Who knows? Anyway, I'm tired. You don't seem to be feeling well. Then I'll sleep earlier. Hey gamers, it seems I've received a text message. And it's from everyone's favorite uh, NCR trooper, Akihiko. Fuka is being released from the hospital. We'll talk to her this evening. Come to the command room as soon as you get back. You're Fuka Yamagishi, right? Shit, I started eating. Oh no. Uh. Yes. <laughs> Relax. There's no need to be nervous. Why don't you have a seat? Everyone, you did an excellent job uncovering the truth. Oh boy. I also wanted to let you know, the three girls have all regained consciousness. Oh? What a relief. From what I understand, they each came to school around midnight and waited for the security guard to leave. They were attacked by shadows near the gate as the dark hour began. However, the facts became twisted because of rumors concerning a ghost story. I knew right from the beginning that it wasn't a ghost. Shut up. It's all my fault. Yes, it is. Are you kidding? You were the victim. But I made so many people worry. Hey, don't think like that. We could have lost that fight if you weren't there. You saved our lives. You should feel good about yourself. I think I could have handled it if I uh, didn't die 82 times. You have a special power that you can use to help others. A special power? We call it Persona. You could be a tremendous help to us. Will you lend us your strength? Are you asking me to join you? Mitsuru Senpai? No! The answer is no! You know, we're not trying to pressure you, so if you need some time to think about it... I'll do it. I'll help you. Are you sure? If you join, you'll have to live here. With Junpei. That's fine. I'd rather live here than at home anyway. Thanks. We really Thanks for alluding this. to your tragic backstory. I can't wait to read all about it. I'm gonna skip all the dialogue. We'll have the school talk to your parents to resolve any issues. 
Thank you. All one of them, right? Wait a minute. Aren't we dragging her into this a bit fast? Maybe. Um, it's okay, really. Now then, those special shadows showed up again. We still don't know where they're coming from, but Akihiko is right about one thing. Their appearances seem to coincide with the full moon. We'll take that into consideration from now on. We will. So they're kind of like werewolves then, huh? Shut up. It's a big advantage for us to know when to expect them. Now, on the day of the fight, we'll be ready to get in the ring. <sighs> I get a feeling that he's been waiting for this! You have discovered a pattern in the appearances of special shadows. You wonder if this is what the boy was trying to tell you. It seems that you should start paying attention to the moon's phases. Because half moons will have mini bosses, right? So much shit is happening in quick succession. You've prevailed yet again. Oh, it's you. But it's funny. I just want to eat my goddamn cheese at you, mysterious boy. It doesn't seem so certain considering the vast potential within you. As a matter of fact, your power seems to have changed quite a bit. Yeah, Pyro Jack. Hey, if you don't mind, can I be your friend? I'm very curious about you. Is that okay? Sure. Anything other to call you than Mysterious Boy? Name? Oh, I see. I need a name. My name is Pharos. Pharos. Well, let's... Plug that into the mythology, uh, reader, after this you episode. You may call me that if you wish. Well, thank you, Pharos. Very co Wait, this is an actually a... Oh, no. Mysterious voice rings out in my head. I just had one of these. Oh, fuck. Thou shalt have our blessing when... Thou choosest to create personas of the Death Arcana. You have established a new social link. I'm... I'm weary of you. It's getting late, so I'll go now. Thank you, Pharos. Very I'm cool. I'm already looking forward to our next meeting. Uh... 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 uh sure, buddy. Goodbye. And then... And then... He was given the Death Arcana out of nowhere. Scariest shit I've ever seen. Relevant plot! Right? Or am I just stupid? There's voice acting, Mind right? Mind if I interrupt? Yeah, there's voice acting. This ought to be relevant. I was just told by the chairman that he'll be stopping by this evening. When you get back, come to the fourth floor meeting room. Oh, um, okay. I'll see you all later. Damn, I love plot that informs me of other ongoing plots. It's awesome. In fact, it's crazy. DOG! Koro-chan, give me your paw. Oh, good dog! Uh, an animal that... Wait. Let's hope... The... Let's hope to God this thing doesn't talk. Ikari and Fuka are playing with a dog. Oh, hi. Hey, you're back. Welcome back. What's up with the dog? Does it talk? Is it gonna be an annoying little sidekick? Oh, he's just walking down the street. Koro-chan, go say hi. His name's Korumaru. I've seen him sitting by the steps of the shrine. Oh, 
This dog still goes on walks all by himself? What do you mean? He used to belong to the priest at the Naganaki Shrine. Every afternoon, the two of them went this way for a walk. That explains it. Well, until the priest passed away. He passed away? Uh, what is the relevance of all this? Oh, you haven't heard the story? It was about six months ago. The priest was hit by a car while walking his dog. He didn't survive. Ever since then, Damn that dog Al. sits patiently by the sight of the accident. And he goes for a walk every day, just like when his owner was still alive. The woman seems to be very talkative. Oh, shoot, I have to get going. My son will be back soon. Good for you. Why do I need to know this? Oh, you're such a loyal dog. Good boy. Huh? What's wrong? And then the dog started talking and said, Persona! There goes the dog. Oh, nothing. Sorry. Wait, isn't the chairman coming today? What a shame. Then we should go get ready. I hope there's more puns in the recording booth later. Hello, everyone. Oh, boy! I want to let you know how my research has been going. Poorly. This concerns those shadows that have been appearing during full moons. I want you to listen closely. It might be hard to follow. Shadows can be divided into 12 categories according to their characteristics. This we've known for a while. It's like their class or order. Now, I've classified the special shadows we've seen so far and it's simply fascinating. Oh, someone's happy. And? Oh, sorry. <clears throat> Those four shadows belong to categories one through four in order of their appearance. They may have looked different than the more common ones, but the classification scheme still applies. What about the one shadow with tits that had BJ written on them? Is that something we should be excited about? No, oh, I get it, it. Isn't. there's 12 in all. Eight we haven't seen yet. What? That's exactly right, Fuka. You're quite sharp. So what, I get eight more boss fights before the game ends? Is that it? Oh, uh, okay, but what are they after? Joe, Mama. That's a good question. And that's what we haven't figured out yet. Their motive. Aww, ooh. They don't kill their prey. They feed on their minds. It can be considered predation. But is it really? Is there an underlying intent behind their behavior? That smile is creeping me the out, The purpose man. of the shadows as a whole. That's what we need to consider. This is interesting. But no matter what, we still have to beat the rest of them. I agree. That's about all we can do at this point. Could we mayhaps nuke Tartarus? Eight more, huh? Lucky us. According to the data, each one has been stronger than the last, so we better start training harder. We'll manage. We've got plenty of time. What about Tartarus? Why does it even exist? And can we bomb the shit out of it? Oh? The pieces are falling into place one by one. <laughs> I have no idea what's going on. But the shadows that appear when the moon is full, you wonder what their purpose is. Eight of them remain. You still have a long road ahead of you. Ah, oh, come on. The moment I tried to hit the pause button, something ha like this happens. Let me guess, small child? Oh. Huh? How the heck did I... What the hell is this? 
Good evening. Huh? Are you surprised? Who the fuck are you three? The followers of the apocalypse? Truth be told, we all visit this world every night. What are you saying? Who the hell are you? I would be less belligerent to the three strangely dressed individuals. Didn't mommy teach you any manners? You haven't introduced yourself. Take a look. Oh. Name, address, age, etc. This is you, right? Where did you get this? Somebody's got a grudge against you, and they asked us to get revenge. Revenge? What kind of bullshit is this? Who put you up to this? Can't Come on, man. We're professionals. Professionals? Oh, shit. You mean the rumors on the net are true? Holy fuck! Wait, wait, wait. I haven't done anything. Why me? What did I do? That is not our concern. Your notion of right and wrong is irrelevant. My client's wishes are all that matter. People hear what they choose to hear and believe what they want to believe. <laughs> no! Stay away! Get away from me! Gone. You squeal most magnificently. Such raw emotion. Blow, blow, now the egg-shaped cocksucker's dead. He's not dead. That's a shame. Doesn't matter. We've held up our end of the bargain. Besides, tomorrow this will just seem like some random crime. If there's nothing else, I'm feeling rather tired. Oh fuck, looks like we found our antagonist. Hi, how are you today? Just one? Hi, how are you today? Would you like more plot that'll randomly hit you in the head like a fucking freighter truck and yet don't have time to start recording before you've missed some dialogue? I'll have what he's having. Coming right up. One house special! How can you eat the same thing all the time without getting sick of it? Shut up. You always eat that protein shit. Shit. <laughs> Here you go, one house special. Be careful, it's hot. You still haven't made up your mind? Is that what this is about? We've got four new members. Things have changed quite a bit since you left. We're more aggressive now. I'm not interested. Think about it, Shinji. Don't let your power go to waste. Think, Mark. Think. My power ain't worth shit. Shinji! I made up my mind a long time ago. I ain't going back. Let me guess, you're the healer. <laughs> You have to let the past go. What's done is done. It's time you moved on. <laughs> you should talk. What? Face it. You're no different than me. Sorry to bother you, Fuka. Yo! I'm still recording! And there's relevant plot! Let's fucking go! It's okay. Uh-oh. But I... Uh, well, um... I ain't, I ain't immune to accidentally skipping dialogue. I was hoping you could do me a favor. With your skill. I was doing some research on our school. And I came across something strange. Ten years ago, a lot of students missed school for some reason. They were reported as absent. But I found some records that suggest it was something serious. Do you know anything about it, Fuka? Me? Um, not really. I know it was a long time ago, but... Doesn't... From what I've heard, this isn't the first time shadows have appeared. Wait, are you saying... I don't know, but I wonder... 
And I'm not trying to make trouble, but Mitsuru Senpai acts kind of weird whenever someone asks questions about Tartarus. You could say she's suspicious? Suspicious? Sus? Sussy among us? Does she? I just want to know what happened back then. If it doesn't have anything to do with the shadows, then fine. I understand. Okay, I'll see what I can do. One day more. Another day, another destiny. To this endless road of Calvary. The ominous moon will f surely shine. Just like it did that other time. One day more. Good morning. <laughs> How are you feeling today? Better than ever! Wow, you're amazing. I know. You're gonna have... We're gonna have a quick meeting tonight about the operation. So please return to the dorm immediately after school. No. I don't think I will. <sighs> there will be a full moon tonight. A powerful shadow may appear. You should return to the dorm and prepare yourself. No, I shouldn't. I think what I'll do is I'll... Oh, 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 we're already being thrusted into it. Tails knew he must defend the whole city. Oh, for a second, I thought... Any luck, Fuka? Uh, I'm gonna just beat the shit out of my microphone real quick. Ruin the mic quality. Just a moment. Oh, God. I found it. She I sense a strong presence. Do I get to turn the echo on my microphone, too? No. Hey, we were right. Or so it would seem. It's located in Iwatodai, inside a building on Shirakawa Boulevard. Hmm. Shirakawa Boulevard. They've been finding the lost in pairs lately. Now I understand why. In pairs. Who was in pairs? <laughs> oh, I get it. I don't. Why? What's on Shirakawa Boulevard? I'm not familiar with that area. Ciao, Mama. Just realizing I now, it, why is she so small? That's where all those hotels are. <laughs> that explains a lot. Oh. Uh. I get it. You've heard about him, right, Fuka? Where people go to, you know. Chuk chucks! Nonsense. They're no different than ordinary hotels. The rooms are a bit fancier, that's all. Oh, man. That's it? I don't know about this. Maybe I shouldn't go. My muscles, my muscles, involuntarily flex. You're just like a little kid, Yucatan. Look, everyone's trapped inside a coffin by now. It's fine. Whatever. Fine, let's go. But this time, I want a piece of the action. Of course. So, who's gonna take the lead? Me, as always. I don't see any reason to change leaders now. And Yamagishi, I want you to handle support during the operation. I'll do my best. All right, then I'll let you decide on the rest of the team. Let's do this. I'm gonna use the most competent people on the team and Yukari. Because it's either that or Junpei. Do you want to be a part of the party? Answers no. Alright, let's get the fuck out of here. Check on everyone's status. Just so I know. Alright. Let's do this shit. It's gonna be done and over with in the matter of two seconds because I'm gonna get my ass handed to me. Fuck you, Baltimore!
All right. Hey, my persona has a new ability. Huh? I can tell you if the enemy's performance has been altered. This will help you when you're in battle. Thanks, Fuka. Real cool. Something is about to happen to the skill, Dia. Sure, not like I use it. Ah. I'll live with Dodge Electric, I suppose. It's a bit strange, but eh. Good job. That's it. I feel weary. Huh? I was right to be sits. What the fuck? <laughs> Your head feels foggy. Yeah, what the fuck? You hear a shower running in the bathroom. You don't remember why you are here. <laughs> Doesn't matter. Ah! Embrace your desire. A strange voice rings inside your head. I'm the voice of your inner self. Enjoy the moment. That which cannot be felt as merely a dream. The presence is all we have. Who cares? The future is but a fantasy. Memory is fabrication. Let your desire free you from your shackles. Such is my wish. Ah, uh, no. Pleasure is what you truly want. You stand before the doorway to bliss. You cannot deny your instincts. Embrace your desire. Now is not the time for this bullshit. Your mind is fraught with temptation. Now is not the time. Your mind is getting clear. You've regained control of your thoughts. Oh, was I just supposed to be in more of denial? The shower in the bathroom has been turned off. Hi, Yukari. Uh, what was I? <gasps> Ow! It seems Yukari's thoughts were being manipulated as well. Oh, I can finally reach you. Hello, Fuka. Can you two hear me? Unfortunately, yes. I'm sorry I couldn't contact you sooner. The shadow was interfering with your thoughts. Oh, and I could tell. Separated. The enemy is still in the same room. Please regroup and hurry there. Did you hear that, Yukari? Uh, sorry. Yeah, I heard you. Um, did something happen? An unfortunate count no, encounter. No, nothing. Hello, Yukari. How's it going? Come on, let's go. Sick nasty. All right. If you tell anyone, I won't ever speak to you again. You already don't talk to me outside of story relevance. Oh, and I'm the shy one? What did I do wrong? Ugh. All right. Well, 
but... It's a trend. It's a transmogrified guest. It's a transmogrified guest. Aw, no more it's a coffin. We gotta use our big boy words. The door won't budge. Oh, must I go up? I thought I went down, but I guess I must go up. So you guys were on the first floor, huh? Surprised there was another shadow. Anyway, are you alright? How about you? Break a few mirrors! Fight time. It's the source of the mind manipulation. Give me a sec. I'll scan the target. Yeah. Uh, now, if you excuse me, I'm gonna just use my fire move and burn this bitch. I can do it. I guess that's the only thing that matters. Let's go. Ooh. Critical? That's gonna critical. Oh, I thought that was gonna critical. That should look like the battle pass after all. Okay. I hope you knew I hope you use exclusively fire moves so my job becomes a lot easier. It's yours, well, but well. mine will. Let's go. Shit! Do I got an item for that? No, it's just heal time, I suppose. Well, actually, wait. This guy's gonna heal themselves. I'm fine. Ah! Hang in there. Oh, media. That's gonna be useful. I summon me. Ikari, if you could just spam that all this fight, that'd be much appreciated. Sorry, no! Hang in there! Obey my command! Uh. Damn you, Kari, you're gonna heal him? You're gonna you're gonna heal him with your all heal move, which would also heal yourself? No. Great. I summon me! Gotta love you, Kari. One of my most useful teammates. Purely because of the healing. Oh, you gotta be fucking with me. Ah. 
Yeah, because just like when Mitsuro misses with it, you will too. Uh, I get tongue tied mid recording. I, uh, I get tongue tied mid recording, and I look like a moron. Okay, command. My turn. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Ugh. Die, you lustful piece of shit. Hang in there. I like to keep my YouTube safe for work. Thank you very much. Uh the untold horrors of the sex hotel and the level 25 guy who does not care. Hey gamers, welcome I'm to Misery. Junpei, what did you do that Thanks time? Thanks for your help. The enemy was sly, but you did well. I did what I could. And you too. Me? For withstanding the enemy's mental assault. All right, let's call it a night. We did it. We did it. We did it. Yeah, oh, Lois Simo. About that thing you mentioned the other day? You found out something? Something cool. Spoopy? Tell me later. All right, we should head back too. Junpei, you good? Come on, Junpei. What are you doing? So, you're the hero again, huh? Yes. Didn't do much, really. Yeah, whatever. Who cares, anyway? I don't. Hey, why do you have to be like that? Don't tell me you're jealous. Shut up. Shut up. Uh, is it really a jealousy thing? What's up his butt? My dick. Yeah. All right, let's go. <gasps> A mysterious voice rings in your head. Hello, Internet, and welcome to Game Theory. Your team survived another dangerous fight. It seems like the trust between you all the trust between you all has grown. You learned a new tactic. You can now use full assault. What were we half assing our assault? Faster than I expected. Put your shirt on. That was quite a show. They've been rather busy these last few months, including their frequent forays into the tower. Their fighting style is positively fascinating, and it seems they've gained new recruits, too. Well, Jin, are they our enemy? Why don't we ask our buddy? We'll be seeing him soon. Yes, that's an excellent idea. Considering that he shares our fate, it would be prudent to seek his opinion. This is, is, is smartass over here throwing a holding a grenade. We don't have much time left. We got pale ass Jesus. We got fucking liberal and a uh, girl. The girl. You succeeded in defeating the shadows this month too. You expect that there will be fewer victims for a while, but you are too exhausted to think about it now. You decide to rest as soon as you get back to the dorm. And I said, hey, what a wonderful kind of day. We can learn, laugh, and play, and be friendly to each other.
This way, officer. By the time I realized the door was halfway open, his room was already in this state. I've left the place untouched as you requested. Hmm. Whose room is this? Junpei Iori, a junior. I've been attempting to reach him on his cell phone, but he hasn't responded in the last 30 minutes. It was careless of me to let my guard down. This dorm has been attacked in the past. Security is everyone's concern, but if anything happens to him, it's ultimately my responsibility. I hate to say it, Miss Kirijo, but this is most likely... Huh? Mitsuru-senpai? What the hell? Kurosawa-san? What's going on here? Iori? Where were you? I've been trying to contact you. Huh? Oh, uh, it was hot and the AC was busted, so I went to the manga cafe and fell asleep. <sighs> well, I'm just glad you're safe. But if it wasn't an attack, then it must have been theft. Why would the burglar target this room? Theft? What else could it be? Someone clearly tore through the room looking for something. Vandalizing a school dorm. When I find out who did this, I'll see to it that he or she is executed. Uh. Well, son, sounds like you've got a death sentence. <laughs> How about it, Iori? Was this room in fact vandalized? Uh, well, my room always looks like this. W what? B but you can't possibly live here in this state, can you? I could. A and the door was open. Oh, right. I wanted to air the place out while I was gone. No one we don't know ever comes around, so... I think this case is closed. May I return to my duties, Miss Kirijo? Oh, uh, yes. I'm sorry you had to see something so... disgraceful. I apologize for all this. It seems my upbringing may have been more sheltered than I realized. Come on, at least yell at me or something. What's the deal with you calling the police over a messy room anyway? What did I do to deserve this? Hey, wait. That fortune I drew on the way back, it was... Worst luck. The recording ends here. Well, this is a new fun side TV show thing to watch.